Atheist Republic fundraising now on Instagram. So guys, I have been working hard on this. Armin has also been working hard on this. And we now have fundraising available for Atheist Republic directly on your phone on Instagram. So if you go into your Instagram app and you go follow us at Atheist Republic, you will see right at the top of our page, a little fundraising button where we've set our goal and already some people have donated, which is amazing. Um, and this is a fantastic and very convenient way for you to contribute to our work. The um, transactions are covered by the platform. So you're actually giving, you know, more of your money to us instead of some of it being taken, you know, to transfer fees and stuff like that. And um, this is also really cool because Instagram allows you to integrate this function into like your posts and content in really creative ways and in, in, in more fun ways than just a regular, I don't know, like share it on your uh, Facebook story or whatever, or not Facebook story, status. Um, so if you and we're showing screenshots because when you look at it on a computer, you don't actually see these functions. Um, to look in the phone. Yeah, so you have to do this on the mobile. But if you go to our page and then you click on the little button, you will see something that looks like this. And um, so it'll tell you more about our fundraiser to tell about like why we're doing it and you know what Atheist Republic is about. And you can donate there. And then if you scroll down, you can also see that other people who have created stories that use our fundraiser in it. So, and then you can also create your own story on Instagram that shares our fundraiser, promotes it, or maybe show that you contributed to it. Um, and also you can add this button to your own profile and you can add it to your own posts. Um, how, how do you, by the way, I wouldn't read, I, I wrote the caption and I also made a video. I, I'm so uh -huh. proud to show this. But before you, before I show you what I made, how do you add this button? Um, because a lot of people want to help us, but they can't financially. They can't, uh, and they shouldn't because they can. But all they exactly. have to do is is instead of instead of donating financially to us, you can basically add the donate button for Atheist Republic to your own Twitter account. Sorry, sorry, to your own Instagram account. So you could add the donation um, button to your own Instagram account. And you could also share the fundraiser as your story if you want. Mm -hmm. But anyways, well, so well, the way you do one. this is if you, um, I'm just gonna like walk through it on my phone. Uh, unfortunately, we tried to do it so I you like I could share my screen and you guys could see too, um, but it doesn't work on Streamyard. So if you just go to create a new post and you like choose something that you want to post, just whatever, and you go through to where you write the caption. You'll see it. You'll write the caption and it says tag people, add location. You, you don't have to do either of those. And then it says add fundraiser. And uh, I then, don't have that option. Oh, okay. Well, you have to, I think so you have to go to my, you have to, my, and then you just search for whatever setting. nonprofit you want to support. And if you search Atheist Republic, it'll come right up. And then, yeah, you can, you can create a fundraiser on your own posts or your own stories that way. On the stories, what you do is you load the photo that you want and then you flick up so that you get all the options of like adding music or emojis or whatever. And then you can add a donate button and then search for it again that way. Okay, if you don't have that option, like I don't on my personal Instagram account, you could just share it as a the fundraiser as a story. Anyways, I'm gonna read my caption and the video I made because I'm very proud of it. Okay, so this is the caption I wrote. It says, help the atheist republic fight dogma, ridicule superstition, slay sacred, sacred cows, break taboos, and normalize dissent. Help us put people above gods and reason above revelation. Okay, so that was my caption. That's a very snappy uh, caption. I like that. Yeah, you like it? Okay. Yeah. But also, here's the video I made with Susanna's voice. Um. Oh, wait. So before I play this, somebody's asking, can you provide a few more options for tax donations? Laws of country I have and doesn't allow tax-free donation for foreign entities. Okay, we have so, the link to... Yeah, there's there's PayPal in the description and there's Patreon in the description. You could either do Patreon or PayPal, so those options are available. Link I think he's talking about this. 
a specific thing for people in the EU potentially. And there are some services that you sometimes have to like go through to be able to do that kind of thing. No, PayPal. Yeah, I think what he's saying is saying other than these uh, fundraising options that we have. Okay, there are other options which is PayPal and Patreon. Links to those are in the description. I think you should you should be able to use that. But anyways, my video. This is yes, the most please. important part. Okay. okay. <laughs> Atheist Republic has grown from a Facebook page dedicated to giving disbelievers a louder voice to the world's largest community of atheists. Okay, okay, I made another one. I want to show the other one as well. Oh, okay. This one, this one was with Susanna's voice. I also made... Oh, guys, before I show the other one, can I show you something funny? Okay, so this, oh, this, this meme, okay, look at this. This meme was like blocked by Instagram. It says false information. The same information was reviewed by independent fact checkers in another post. Okay, so let's say why this, what information Instagram did had their fact checking team review this meme and it was factually wrong and you know they marked it accordingly. So let's see what was what, what misinformation has Atheist Republic been spreading on Instagram. Okay, so let's see posts. <laughs> Okay. Oh my so, gosh. So. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so for those listening, it's a photo of a child sleeping in the bed. The child is labeled as God. Standing above the bed is a, a soldier with his arms spread and his, he's being lit on fire and grenades and knives are being thrown at him. So the soldier is labeled <laughs> believers and the, the weapons being thrown at him are labeled yeah. insults, satire, sarcasm, criticism, mockery, and abuses. So... <laughs> Instagram is saying that it is false that believers protect their God from insult and mockery and abuse. I don't, okay. I really want to talk to the fact checking team and tell me exactly what research they did to determine that this meme is false information. And what does it mean for this meme to be false information? I don't understand, but it's funny because the whole- Jake B is saying, of... this is actually proving the point of the meme. <laughs> <laughs> oh, true. <laughs> You're right, I actually didn't think about that. Uh, but a lot of people were in the comment were laughing and like somebody reported this, this post as false. Is coming up as false information. Why was this fact checked as false? So many people are commenting about <laughs> laughing at the point. <laughs> I don't know. I kind of, I kind of like it because I think it made the meme even more funnier. I think maybe they're reporting it's false because there is no God. Oh yeah, maybe like we fact check. There is no God. This ba this this baby here can't be God because God is not real. I don't know. <laughs> but anyways, I think the meme became extra juicy because it was is basically it's doing what the meme is telling you that it's a, it's just so ironic. I don't know. Anyways, I want to do where's my video? Oh, this is the video I made. Hold on, we have to Instagram doesn't play the audio at first. You have there to go, go. At the back and then play. Atheist Republic amplifies the voices of atheists worldwide. Let's show our fellow atheists that are not alone. All right, so that was the second video. All right, so yeah. somebody is asking, somebody in the comments is asking, what is the money exactly for? Well, the money is going to cover our expenses, like our accounting fees or legal fees. We have staff that um, write stuff for us. We have software, like video editing software, hosting expenses. We have video editors. We have a social media team that we have to pay. Um, there's a whole bunch of things that we have to file. And it's expensive. Like, we are, it's getting challenging for us to hire um a american accountant or a canadian accountant to keep everything in order so basically all of this costs money and also the people who work at atheist republic have to be able to pay for food and rents and all that stuff so that's where all the expenses goes right so all the money goes there's an amazing amount of overhead that goes just into keeping things into compliance <laughs> um yeah. yeah and um also, I want to save up funds to redo our website. 
So that's a big thing that I want to do with our fund. We also need an emergency fund. We don't, guys, we don't have an emergency fund. We need an emergency fund so that if something bad happens, we have like a, the resources to deal with it. So there's that. So, oh, Imran is saying, oh, damn, you guys are larger operations than I thought. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, it's not just me and Armin. We're just the people that show our face. <laughs> we got a whole squad yeah. behind us. We have a bunch of people that don't like showing, telling everybody that they're working on an, um, spreading blasphemy across the world. <laughs> so spreading corruption or like, yeah, so. Yeah, spreading corruption in the land. Yeah, no, or it's yeah, actually yeah. dangerous for them. So me, yeah. Susanna and Bobak are from the entire team are the people who are willingly coming and showing our faces. The rest are cat. Yeah. We've um, also been putting a lot more investment into the Persian side of Atheist Republic, which I've been really happy about. I think, yeah, yeah that's something I'm really proud of because yeah. I don't know. I really, I, I wish I could like communicate to people on the English side, like all the things we're doing over there. But I think like our community on the Persian side is so, um, it's so rewarding to me to be giving something that is of such high value to the people who like receive our programming there. And it just really comes through in like all the people that come and talk to me about it. Um, but because of the language difference, like there just kind of is a natural divide of these communities. Um, and I wish there was a way to like cross that bridge more because we got like so much cool stuff going on over there, but it doesn't really come into this sphere. Um, and, um, should be saying instagram oh, wait this is important sorry. indians can't donate through youtube will instagram w donation work for us i don't know because i'm not based in india so if you could give it a shot and then tell us if it works for you please let me know um that would actually be very helpful information for me but you could become a youtube member so there's that and then if you're a youtube member then we will highlight your comments more often and then you, you get to come, come talk, talk to us on the q and a's Yes, absolutely. You get um, access to the emojis. Now I think we have enough members for me to add some more emojis, so that's really good. Or my goal is to have at least a hundred YouTube members because then we have like a ton of emojis. I want even more. I want even more. More emojis. I have them in the vault ready to go. We just need more members before I can add them. Um Dory, I love this comment. Dory, I've had it saying it's show and tell day for Armin. That's exactly what I was thinking. You're like, look guys, yeah. I made a video. It's so cute. <laughs> Haley Nazi. Um, ha and then uh, Noman is asking, how can I become a member of your squad? Um, well, there's a lot of different ways. You can join our communities on Facebook. So if you go to atheistrepublic.com slash consulates, you can find our international group on Facebook where we have over 80,000 people that you can engage with. Or you can find a local what if they in your think area. But then if you want to support what, us, there's a lot of different ways to do that. So if you want to support us financially, you don't have to. No, no, there's I think, other free options as well. I don't but, think that's what he means. I think what he means is like as a volunteer. I think that's what he means. Like come in and assist and join the staff team. I think that's what he means. Oh, um, if that's the case, you can email me at Susanna at atheistrepublic.com. Um, my name is spelled like this, S-U-S-A-N-N-A -N -N -A, at atheistrepublic.com. And... Oh, Pember. Tell oh, me about me. what your skills are, what your skill set is, what you're good at, and what you'd be interested in contributing. Um, I was wrong. And, I was wrong. Um, and no man means, I mean, I am, I'm a member. Oh, no, no. I thought this is what I mean. Okay, so you're already a member of Patreon. Yeah, so I think he means like, oh, no, I was right. I think he means like staff. Members. So, okay, yeah, so email Susanna. Susanna at atheistrepublic.com. We need, yeah, we need, tell me what you're good at, what do you want to get involved in, and maybe guys, I can find a place need, for you. We need video editors. That's what we need. Okay, fine. Let her speak. I did let her speak. Okay. What? What? Are, like, you guys are like such like okay. Are, like, is are you a boy? Are you trying to be like? Are you trying to be a white knight for Susie? Oh my god. Susie, not you're being defended. No, okay, I, Susie. I, like, okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. Okay. Um. The, guys, we're oh yeah, there's a, there's a lot of atheists on Clubhouse. Well, we're active on Clubhouse. We are atheist republic. Well, on the Persian, Persian side, on the Persian side, we are active on Clubhouse. Yeah, guys, you have no idea. Our, our Persian side of atheist republic is doing a lot of work. We're active on Clubhouse. We're active on YouTube. 
and there's a lot of demand for what we're doing over there and we are going to be active hopefully on instagram as well uh, we have arabic we have an arabic um, content that is constantly being made if you guys could introduce more people to our arabic channel that that part needs some marketing so please help us with that mm, what else we have the african ch youtube channel and we have a lot of filipino activists and in, we in india we have a lot of consulates that are doing active work but we, yeah so which we have, actually reminds me shri yash is asking the indian consulates aren't listed on the website yes the administrators of our indian consulates have requested that we take them down from public viewing because that's how bad the backlash against um atheist republic because of the sexy kali blossomy was that they were getting death threats so for their own protection they asked that we take it down which is so shocking because we have the ones for pakistan and saudi arabia publicly available but anyways so if you're in india and you want to get involved in our indian community one of the best ways to do it is to email me at susanna at atheistrepublic.com and i can get you hook up hooked up with and, and tell me which big city is closest to you um, I can get you hooked up with our local consulates. We have like over 14 to 18 Indian consulates and it's one of our biggest communities. Mm. Would we ever be able to publicly list them again, the Indian ones? Or yeah, occasionally I touch base with the administrators and see what they think. And I, I, I really want them to lead that decision. Mm -hmm. um, so I, I leave it in their hands. You tell me, you know. Okay, good. That's a good call. Hey guys, if you're a fan of Blasphemy and Sexy Callie, you know, like me, then you need to be sure to subscribe to our newsletter, link in the description below. Because if you subscribe, we will send you a free copy of our Blasphemous Art ebook. And let me tell you, it is the tastiest Blasphemy that you can find anywhere available today. And we are so generous with our blasphemy that we continue to send you more blasphemy every week. So make sure to subscribe. Link in the description below.